He was under
sodium nitrate. When you put it in the water, you write it in the water. If you use the water, you will get it. And then you can use it. Then you can use it. Because uh, oxygen where it is water only it will become. So what it gives? And hydrogen will be highly flammable and it will become evolved. Hydrogen will evolve and it gets fire. Then yeah, others are not suitable for the sunlight. Temperature the temperature will drop from the hydrogen gas. That's why it becomes almost hot. But even if you feel that they are hotness, right? Because of that, gas is present. What is the gas? So in the sand, the soda reacts. Take it this one. So the hydrogen pushes the air. Okay. So the reactivity based on what? The reactivity of metal based on what? Let's say highly reactive. Let's say
which are the following property is not a characteristic of metal but metal is just a high density hardness and then poor low metric conductivity which are the following metal generally occur in liquid state mercury bromine aluminum ओके तो मेटल व्हिच इज जनरली अकर इन लिक्विड स्टेट इज मर्क्युरी एंड कैलियम ओके रिएक्टिविटी ऑफ जिंक is dash that then hydrogen less than more than equal sometime more sometime less more than equal okay zinc plus x moles of hydrochloride it gives Zinc chloride plus hydrogen. In the above reaction, sorry, so what is the x and what is dash this you have to find out so what reaction will takes place between these two is it n plus 2 hcl it gives good when sodium react with cold water the product formed will be sodium react with cold water the product will be na2o you could not see a so cold na2o naoh na2co3 and all which one answer na good so what is the decreasing order of reactivity decreasing what is that sodium aluminum copper argentinum iron you tell me
ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಏನಕ್ಕೆ ರಿಯಾಕ್ಟಿವಿಟಿ ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಸೋಡಿಯಂ ಐ ಲೆಫ್ಟ್ ಒನ್ ಮೋರ್ ಮೆಟಲ್ ಐ ಥಿಂಕ್ ಸೊ ಪೊಟ್ಯಾಷಿಯಂ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಪೊಟ್ಯಾಷಿಯಂ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ದೇರ್ ಪೊಟ್ಯಾಷಿಯಂ ಸೋಡಿಯಂ ಕ್ಯಾಲ್ಸಿಯಂ ನಾಟ್ ಕಾಪರ್ ಅದು ವಾಟ್ ಐ ಸೇ ಅಡ್ತೆ ಏನ ಸೊನ್ನಿಂಗ ಅಲ್ಯೂಮಿನಿಯಂ ಅಲ್ಯೂಮಿನಿಯಂ ಐಎನ್ ಕಾಪರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಸಿಲ್ವರ್ ವೆರಿ ಗುಡ್ ಆನ್ಸರ್ ಇಸ್ ರೈಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದೆ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ when metal is added to dilute hcl solution there is no evolution of gas then what is the metal so you are adding metal and dilute hcl no h2 gas so avanga endha enna metal kuduthirukanga na they given potassium sodium silver and zinc which one which one ma which metal seriliya hmm ena adu noble metal among the three very good next on addition of which metal copper sulfate solution blue color will be changed to color the solution so when you are adding metal to the copper sulfate could you see that or i have tried a little okay so the metal and the copper sulfate is it okay so it will be changed to the blue color become colorless then which metal it will be iron silver zinc mercury silver and does not uh, undergo displacement reaction it seems which is you uh, take iron iron silver zinc very good when you are taking iron it become green so this is not answer then silver is a less reactive metal it does not displace when compared to copper it is a less reactive what about zinc and mercury you tell me among zinc and copper which is reactive zinc is reactive so it can exchange so that zinc plus copper sulfate gives zinc sulfate plus copper 2 plus sorry copper become copper okay so that's why what is the answer become zinc zinc plus h2o steam will give a plus b what is that
Zinc oxide. Very good. And which of the following metal react vigorously with the oxygen? So, metal with oxygen. Zinc, magnesium, sodium, and copper, which is Hmm? Hello. It's react vigorously with oxygen. Vigorous. Immediate fire. Which one can give? Sodium will give? Huh? No. So, copper is wheat layer. Copper is in cell. That is fire. Huh? Sodium only. So, okay. Is it clear? So, now the net is going to be done. Now the continuous. So, we know that the metals are available at the earth crust. So, we need to purify. Generally, for all the metal, we will not have the same procedure for the purification. We will have different method for the purification of the metals. But, it generally occurs with this process. What are the process? Number one, crushing. The color theory, the crushing of ore or otherwise grinding. Since your ores are like rock. The rock you cannot enter into the machine, no. So you need to crush it. So always the first step is crushing of the ores, and the second step is concentration. When you are taking the rice, before rice, how it will be? It present along with the rest, right? So you have to remove that. So that is called as concentration. 
so whatever the unwanted things you don't want you have to remove it so you have to take the exact part of your metal which is the reactive part you need to isolate that process is known as concentration of the ores or otherwise it is called enrichment of the ore then extraction of metal after concentrating you need to extract the metal for example you are having copper sulfate along with the aluminum sulfate like that so you need to extract only the copper sulfate so you need to extract only the copper that is known as extraction okay and then finally it will come refining or purification so these are the four step always it involve in the metallurgy so in the step 2 and 3 will become more now crushing and grinding of ores it's nothing but you are breaking down the bigger one into smaller one and then you have the sieves the so tea strainer mari sieves irukum appo the pore size will be there no that what are the pores is we want we can filter up like ball milling ipo and idella pathina building build pandra edala paathirukinga appo or round da or rotation la or salad maru potirukom have you seen that why they have taken that what they are doing no the same thing crushing of pore only they are doing what they are doing edhuk adu pot use pandranga மணல்ல they will uh, save the unwanted thing so why they are doing like that to remove the unwanted thing same way so when you are breaking you will have the biggest one and smallest one like that different sieve so when you are using that sieve so you can filter the mesh size the mesh size will become somewhat uniform for that reason only they are doing crushing and boring so the crushing and ores uh, grinding will takes place by using the ball mill or stamp mill okay va add the concentration so by using ball mill or stamp mill concentration or enrichment okay so generally the concentration will become hydraulic washing for flotation and then magnetic magnetic separation first 
hydrolytic washing so idoda principle enna na when the metals and the impurity having the difference in the density so hydrolytic washing mean washing with water running water la inge parunga running water la namm or certain things eduth wash pandrom nichinga appo lighter density la enna pannum it will go along with the running water the heavier density metal enna pannum it will be settled down in the bottom of the pot so so what is the principle behind that density theriliya idella battery adu flat ah charge சரி <laughs> 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 முடிச்சிட்டு <laughs> So is it easier to understand my class? Are you able to follow me? School will teach for longer, coach for longer. Huh? They will teach. Huh? What do you find extra things in this class? Just now. Taste it. Then. Hmm. Okay. Then. The class is so both the same. The school and center. We're learning the same thing. Okay, switch it. Back side now. Let's switch off. A switch. Angelia. Yeah. Na patale ni kaya tan na niya dapat solo la. you are learning the same but you need only the test only you need coaching not the teaching right teachers also put more effort in school also right but why you are not getting the mark then it's not sufficient for you right they are efficient but it's not sufficient for you abadi illaya ungalku da adu sufficient ah illa then mark illaya school la appo inga vandu mark illa
அப்பத்திலிருந்து பாக்கணும் அப்பதான் உங்க பிராக்டிஸ் ஆகும் இல்லையா கொஸ்டின்ஸ் அதுக்காக தான் கொஞ்சம் டிஃப்ரெண்டா கேட்கறது டிஃப்ரெண்டா அப்ப திடீர்னு போயிட்டு எக்ஸாம் எழுதும் டிஃப்ரெண்டா வந்து அவங்களுக்கு எப்படி இருக்கும் கொஞ்சம் டிஃபிகல்டி கொடுத்தாதான் நீங்க நெக்ஸ்ட் என்ன இருக்குன்னு பாப்பீங்க இல்லைன்னா அது ஒரு மாதிரி ஆயிடும் இல்லையா so the concentration or enrichment of ore following the three steps one will be hydrolytic washing the second one is fourth rotation a four th throat கண்டுபிடிச்சா போன வாரம் எவ்வளவு ஹாட்டா இருக்கு ரொம்ப இந்த வாரம் எவ்வளவு போட்டா இருக்கு மழைதான் ரீசன் வர சரி ஸோ ஹைட்ராலிட்டிக் வாஷிங் மீன்ஸ் த வாட்டர் வில் பி ரன்னிங் ஓகே ஸோ டிஃப்ரெண்ட் இன் தயர் டென்சிட்டி இட் ஷோ நோட் ஸோ பேஸ்ட் அப்பான் த டிஃப்ரென்ஸ் இன் தயர் டென்சிட்டி த ஓர் பார்ட்டிக்கல் அண்ட் இம்பியூரிட்டி ஸோ வென் த ரன்னிங் வாட்டர் இஸ் கோயிங் யூ ஆர் டேக்கன் த ஒரு ஓர் ஓகே யூ ஆர் கேப்பிட் இந்த ரன்னிங் வாட்டர் so the impurity will be impurity or gang will be run away from with the water and the remaining will be settled down in the bottom so when you are take and filter up you can get it okay thanni kotra thanni illa nama podum podum bodu and the run idula vandu veliye pogum epdi and the rask epdi separated from the rice so adhe podum thanni la podarna adhu nama arsil apdi podrono nanchuma apdi mele vandu float aagum correct ah so adu apdi filter pannite remaining we will get it so lesser density will be float more density will be settled down so it's not 100% pure you, you can get it but you can remove most of the unwanted things mostly and then froth flotation so from this flotation what you can do now so this based on the wetting property the principle is wetting properties of ores and gangs impurities so certain things have hydrophilic certain things are hydrophobic what is the meaning of hydrophilic hydrophobic they are water loving water hating 
so they will be dissolved in water or they are not dissolved in water so when you are taking oil uh, you are adding water they will not miscible okay so if you are giving the gas that impurity will be coming away okay so based upon the principles of difference in the wetting properties of ore and the impurity with water and oil water eduthukrom oil eduthukrom oil is hydrophobic water is hydrophilic you are having that you are putting the ores whichever having the affinity with the water it go to the water so whichever is not affinity with your water it come away with the oil so when you are give the fourth okay it gives like a effervescence mari apdi or fourth all that you can purify it okay so next magnetic separation based on the magnetic property pona varume na sonna illaya magnetic properties of your ores and the impurities now what are the ores which can purify by hydrolytic washing so ores of ions can be purified by this method because ores of iron and tin ores of iron and tin comma lead ores of iron tin and lead okay so this can be purified because they are very hard you can purify by this method hydrolytic washing other impurities will go galena lead means galena iron is hematite okay or pyrolusite that and all you can purify and then froth flotation so mostly the sulfide ores mostly sulfides ores of copper zinc lead because lead vandu unakku sulfide la irukku galena okay and then magnetic separation so you can purify the ores of iron ores of iron example hematite idu eppadi nu pathinga vechingala or rendu wheel irukku ipdi okay ipdi irukku நெட் கனெக்ட் ஆகும்ல தெரியலையா கனெக்டிவிட்டி போயிடுச்சா சுத்துதான் தெரியுது <laughs>
இம்பியூரிட்டிஸ் <laughs> இப்போ ஏர் உள்ள வருது அந்த அந்த போர்ஸ் வழியா அந்த டாட் டாட் இருக்கு இல்லையா ஒரு மாதிரி அந்த போர்ஸ் வழியா இதுக்குள்ள வந்து இப்ப என்ன பண்ண போகுது இம்பியூரிட்டி எல்லாம் ஒரு சைட்ல எடுக்க போகுது பாருங்க சல்பைடு ஓர்ஸ் எல்லாம் ஒரு சைடும் ரிமைனிங் அந்த கிளியர் ஸோ ஓர்ஸ் இன் த டாப் அந்த ரிமைனிங் வில் பி இந்த பாட்டம் ஸோ விச் எவர் ஹேவிங் த ஹையஸ்ட் டென்சிட்டி ஆர் அபினிட்டி வித் ஆயில் இட் கம்ஸ் த பாட்டம் ரிமைனிங் வில் கம் டு ஓகே ஸோ யூ கேன் டேக் இட் தே கலெக்டட் லுக்கிய so that fourth will be collected in the side of the tube so it will become so the impurity will be collected in the bottom clear is it clear no adutha Hmm. So the simplest way. It's magnetic separation now. You have heard it. running so different the gravity so water running water will be mail and will be okay va so edhuk difference kammiya irukko that will be par ga ipdi wash panna So, heavier particles, lighter particles over the time, heavier particles over the time. ரெண்டு வீல் இருக்கு ஒரு நிமிஷம் அந்த வீல் வந்து சரிங்கண்ணா ரொட்டேட் ஆகும் போது ஒரு வீல் சைட்ல வந்துட்டு பாருங்க எலக்ட்ரோ மேக்னட்டிக் ரோலர்ஸ் அது மேல இருந்து அந்த ஓர்ஸ் வருது நான் மேக்னட்டிக் எல்லாம் இங்க வருது எதுக்குலாம் மேக்னட்டிக் ப்ராப்பர்ட்டி இருக்குமோ அது இந்த வீலோட ஒட்டிட்டே வரும் சோ சட்டன் ஸ்டேஜ்ல வரும்போது அந்த இடத்துல இப்ப இந்த வீல்ல மேக்னட்டிக் ப்ராப்பர்ட்டி இருக்கிறதுனால 
separate all. So look here. This is not fourth rotation. So this is the magnetic separation. And the wheel carry down with the render portal. The wheel is rotated. The wheel is rotated. Magnetic properties are rotated. Then whatever which is having non-magnetic will be filled in that container. So which is having the magnetic, it comes to the sum. Either uh, direction magnetic or remaining will be filled up. It then passes. That's it. Look. Render the burden. So, in your name, in your name. See, this is non magnetic. This is magnetic. Yeah, the road is magnetic property. It is like magnetic material. So, the road is the material remain available. So, this is the easiest way to separate. Okay. So, we will meet in the Friday. Friday, in a month, what we can do. First chapter, Friday, in a month, or second chapter. Like two hours is their class. We'll plan accordingly. Anything we can erase, not that we can erase. Shall we erase this chapter one? Or chapter two? Oh, okay. So we can erase both chapter one and okay. we'll meet at five. Thank you.